accessories of all kinds grace the heads of influencers, it girls, and runway models. Here to show you what you need and how to wear them is Julia McEwen. How are you? I'm good. Uh, really good. I wish it was a hat girl because, my goodness, there's so many good ones out there. So you have three different categories of accessories that you might want to add to your repertoire. Exactly, yeah. I mean, I think in my humble fashion expert opinion, we are in the golden age of hair accessories. Yes. And what a time it is to be alive because there are <laughs> so many options. And if you're not a hat person, yeah. you can do a hair band, you can do a hair clip. Yes. But speaking of hats. Let's start with hats. Yeah, maybe we'll, we'll, we'll start with this kind of contemporary minimalist vibe. I love it. Um, these hats here are from a brand new line. It's Canadian. It's called Joel, um, uh, Joel Joseph. Okay. And I love them. The structure on them is incredible. So they're like, yeah, knock, Real, knock, knock. Exactly. It's, it's like, going to stay that way. It will stay right? that way, right? Yeah. As long as you take care of it. Yes. Um, but what I learned from the designer is that if you're not a hat person, try a larger brim. So oh. a larger brim is a good entry point into in, into the hats hat market. Filled. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Because I think a lot of us would be good in hats, but we just don't try them. To absolutely. You kind of have to get out there and try them and see what look is going to be your look. There's different ways to wear it, right? You can yes. wear it right on the head. You can, you can wear it on the back. back of the head. Right. Yep. Um, and a smaller brim, we have something like this. Okay. Which is poppies and peenies. Yes. Oh, try that's poppies and peenies. Yes. That's nice that they now are doing. Uh, they're now doing hats, but. See? This is like this is sort of a look that a lot of people do that I'm like, I don't know. It's definitely a look. <laughs> yes. This where I can't put it down on my hair because I'm on TV and I'm gonna ruin it. There's that look. But you would go up a size, right? That's yes. a medium. So this is a little bit too small for my big yes. head. Yes. But a beautiful structure. Right. Uh, you just gotta take care of them. And by that you mean what? Do we need to put it in a in like where does it need to sit? Uh, for in something the house? like this, it would be a hat box. A hat if you box. have if you have a globe, like a yeah. uh, that's a great place to kind oh, of rest smart. it on. So you can yeah. find anything that creates that shape. Um, love here, it. love these headbands. They're, They're really a lower hot. profile. You can get them in a number of different price points. Like this one here is from H&M. It's $10, nice. right? So you can buy into it no matter what. Yeah. Love these very minimalist style ones. This is from a new company called IE. Okay. And everything is made in small batches. I'm just going to um, tip this over so you can see what it looks like. But yeah. it's, it's like the barrettes that we were wearing in elementary school, but they're back and they're a little bit more stylish and they're chunky. Totally. So and people I are wearing them sort of together. Yes, you would wear them together. They're sold together as a yeah. set of two, so a set of two here, and they're thirty-five dollars. Excellent. Yep, really nice. Okay, so this is all minimalist. Are we continuing in minimalist? Or are we going into a different well, let's, category? Let's go here. into this area okay, here. What this, are we calling this? Well, I call it the magpie category, but it's the glam <laughs> category. <laughs> yeah. You know, I love, I like, I like a little bit of a sparkle. Bit of bling. Um, so this this speaks to my style sensibility, and you know, this is a lot of fun, right? It's also a great time to buy into this. This trend for holiday so think, yes right um, absolutely so so you've got the headbands here like okay. you had there but these ones are just so blinked very out very embellished right I've been told that uh, the way to do them now though is to just to put them on top exactly so they're not doing they're not actually holding back your hair anymore you're right. just putting it on your hair and it it serves as it's almost like a little hat but I will say a fascinator a good hack if you have bangs yeah like I do and I don't wash my hair as much as maybe I should. You don't have to, that's you know, okay. Day four, yeah. <laughs> I take something like this. Yeah. Um, and this one here is from Amazon.ca, very affordable place to get them. Yeah. And you just kind of pull it right back oh, and good. it gives you like a completely different look, yeah, that's right? Lovely. So that's it really saves great. you time and it saves you a hair wash. Yeah. So that's good for great. You. Yeah. Any like anything that will work in order to not wash your hair one more day right? is a good thing. I'm loving these little blinged out barrettes as well. So, so cute. So the message uh, barrettes or the message yeah. pins are a really big Hi. trend right now. Um, those yeah. ones that you're holding are from H&M. Nice. We got some from Simon's, yeah. from Le Chateau. So very easy entry price points that you can buy into the trend. Very nice. Yeah. And these I've worn many, many times on the show. Yes, so I have So these are a lot of fun. Yeah. They're big and they're bold. You're not like, if you put them in, people are going to notice. They're going to be looking at your head. Yeah. So be okay with that. Exactly. Okay, so we've done the middle category, a little bit of bling. What are we calling this category? This is Lovely. a little, yeah, this is a little bit more of the boho category. So okay. we've stayed away from any kind of bejeweling, any kind of stones. Um, 
I just love the Lex textures, right? Yeah. We have some nice prints going on. These are great head wraps. So awesome. if you're just not dexterous with the hair, don't know yeah. what to do, it is gorgeous to kind of put it there, yeah. put it into a low ponytail and you're good to go. Great colors. Ladies, if the weave has grown out. Yep. <laughs> Or and the roots. It's a little, you got a couple of weeks till your appointment. Yeah. This is what you need. Because you need like a headband plus. Exactly. Right? It's going to be all XL. over here, which <laughs> yeah. is perfect. Yeah. And these are from that uh, same company, uh, IE. So, yeah, oh, really nice. great. Um, hello. Scrunchies are hot. Right? They're everywhere. My daughter must have like 20 of them. And she thinks that they're the newest invention. Right. <laughs> Yeah, and they really, I think they were the catalyst that brought the hair accessory movement to where we are. Yes. Um, and yeah, it's 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 amazing. I, I just love it. I love that. Very if you don't want to tie this onto the back of your hair, yeah, you can, can do, do something like that. And it's got a beautiful uh, ribbon attached to it. So all very girly. And so I noticed there is this sort of return to femininity happening. Absolutely. But folks are doing it, sort of rocking it out and not taking it so seriously and not being so precious with it. Right. Which I think is really nice. It is.